Hi guys, uh, we have a scenario here. Like uh, the wiper on the other hand uh, is not working. So I'm trying to figure out why the wiper is not working when the jet was is working. So I try to figure out whether or not the fuse is gone. But uh, I uh, I put it check the fuse. They're all uh, good. And then I knock also the motor there as you can see. And when I knock the motor, uh, the wiper like uh, start moving and then stop. So the reason for that, I was also trying to check the connector on the uh, wiper stock here. As you can see, I remove all the shit here on the dashboard, and since uh, it's good now, so I will put this back on. And then the reason why the wiper is not working because the one of the either one of the freaking <coughs> relay there is is one of the relays, but so. To determine I don't have the diagram or whether which uh, I don't have the since we don't have the diagram I don't have the diagram on that uh, relay which one for the wiper or whatever but uh, I just changed the <coughs> three of them the relay 100% uh, one of them is for the wiper and one of them is for the uh, lights headlights indicator lights and whatever but uh, yeah when I change when I change the three relays in there fuse relays relays and then I found out that the wiper starts working you can see wiper working now and then yeah so that's the reason why if the if the wiper is not working guys so you have to suspect the relay on the top in there you see that there those three relays have to be changed um uh, we don't have uh, I don't have the diagram either or it's not written on the board motherboard where where we can find the wiper relay so just to avoid the, the benefit of the doubt just change the three relay in there and then that will bring out and uh, your wiper will be working so that's it so I even strip this uh, wiper stock here and uh, the wiper stock is uh, still in good form since uh, see that that is very brand new that is brand new I don't know uh, when this was uh, replaced but uh, it looks like brand new so 100% it's working as you can see and then uh, yeah and then that's how to diagnose the wiper the wiper is not working very common on the thing if wiper is not working then you have to tap the wiper motor a few times and then if it's not working again then you have to check the check the connector or check uh, the wiper stock and the last thing last thing the last thing to do is the fuse check the fuse here i think uh, that's number 18 blue fuse in here on this panel here inside and then uh, there are a lot of things to be checked actually so that's the relay in there has to be changed as well to avoid the benefit of the doubt 
that the relay might be bad so change it and then once you change the relay here the wiper back in action so this is how to diagnose a wiper guys because the wiper is very important and if the wiper not working so we're gonna have to BOR the bus like cannot be release so here we are wiper working and that's it so again uh, to wrap up the video that we have here if you encounter wiper not working actually I did I I go further talaga I go further uh, the next time when you when you uh, diagnose wiper you have to straight away change that uh, freaking relay there those three really have to be changed straight away even if uh, if you are on the breakdown whatever change the three wipers are uh, three relays in there and then if the relays are changed and still not working Tap the wiper motor so those are very common uh, scenario and the last thing to do if still not working then the wiper stock those are the three things wiper stocks wiper stock to be diagnosed and the motor and then the relay and that's it okay and then we'll just put the thing back on together like it should be put it back on so I should be checking the wiper um, uh, relay change the relays So let's go to the long method here. So the next time you have only you have only ready the clue before going up like uh, diagnosing further. So you need to change the relay first. The next time change the relay. Don't uh, don't follow me because I I I go further with the diagnosing on why the wiper is not working. So the next time you have you have already the clue. Uh, change first of all change the wiper relay. And after changing the wiper relay, then you can. That's the time you can go further like on your diagnosing or investigation why the wiper is still not working so it has to be like that I am not really a rocket science here so I go further but uh, the next time uh, I put the, the clue so that's it okay keep this thing going here because the, we need really the the street light is very very highly demand so we need this bus to keep going okay So that's all you need to do guys. Ah. Don't follow my uh, don't follow my procedure because uh, if 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 you want because I diagnose further like so I open up 
everything and then it turns out that the wife is the only the relay is not is the only fault so the next time guys uh, you have really the clue first thing to figure out to change change the relay and after you change the relay then hundred percent that should be working and if it is and if it is not working then you gonna that's the time you go further with your uh, diagnosing diagnostic okay so everything working now uh, where we need to go okay we just put this back on here okay that's it so I am very sorry for the inconvenience because uh, yeah I'm trying to figure it out why the wiper is not working and I, I diagnose further but uh, anyway and the next time change the relay that relay there should be changed before you go further on your uh, diagnosing, di investigation or diagnosing wiper not working.